making her way to the ring from Staten Island, New York, the Princess of Staten Island, Carmella. Byron, are you ready to admit the truth yet? That Carmella is the most obnoxious woman in the entire women's division? You are delusional. Mella is money. Well, it's great where you can wear blinders. Why would I want blinders on when Mella's around? So what would you know anything about how to win a title like Mella? So I see you're kissing up to Carmella as well. Why wouldn't I? I think she's an unbelievable talent. Mella is money. Look who's here! And her opponent, from Moscow, the ravishing Russian, Lana! The ravishing Russian has been ridiculed and written off her entire career. But here tonight, she's looking to have the last laugh and crush the competition. Anybody that's ever ridiculed Lana doesn't know what they're talking about. She's incredibly beautiful. Byron. Incredibly talented. Byron. Speaks like 31 languages. Byron. Was a former social ambassador for Rusev. Byron. Oh, Byron no. has none of those things. Well, I know, but Byron's criticized all those things. I did not. That's not true. I respect Lana. And we get underway with the pride of Moscow, Lana, looking to turn this Cold War red hot. I don't know who's looking more forward to this, the women in the ring or me. Carmella is on the attack. And she hits the drop kick. Look out, there she goes. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. making her presence known. For as good as Carmella is, Corey, the unfortunate truth is she's not above bending the rules a bit to gain an advantage. <laughs> I don't know what's so unfortunate about that, Cole. The goal is to win, and there are few better at finding different ways to win than Carmella. It's not her fault the officials don't know how to do their jobs. Nice job by Lana. Hair whip! Well, Corey currently has no issue with Carmella's nefarious in-ring style, but Byron, her opponents most certainly do. They do, Michael, but they also know what they're getting into ahead of time. So they know that they have to be on the lookout all match long for any shortcuts Carmella might take. Great offense by Lana. Looks like she wants the win early. And Carmella pops the shoulder up. She's still in this one. Carmella is more dangerous than ever. Princess of Staten Island is filled with a hostility we've never seen before. So if a superstar is going to go up against her, they have to strike early. Carmella with a nice reversal. Whoa, a lot of able to avoid damage. I don't want to know what that feels like. Corey, before you mention that Carmella is more aggressive than ever, if an opponent wants to have any sort of chance against the Princess, they'll need to land significant offense right from the opening bell. I'm all for sportsmanship, but in WWE, you have to know when to fight fire with fire. To all the women in WWE, 
To even be able to think about victory against Carmella, you have to strike first. Strike. Lana might get an early three count. Oh, man, she's rolling now. She goes for the cover. That's not going to do it. Oh, wow. She's on the attack and on the move. Oh, man. She hits it. Lana brings everyone to their feet. She has got to take advantage. She goes for the cover. And you can put this singles match in the books. That match might go down as one of the best matches in WWE history. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. From the opening bell, this match was one for the ages. I'm almost speechless. Almost. Here is your winner, the Ravishing Russian, Lana! Strategy fell into place with that victory. I don't think she's ever looked more dominant. And I can imagine there aren't too many people at home regretting tuning in for that amazing match. Wow.